Assembly woman from the Bronx wants to make sure everyone has a coat so they can stay warm. Yes, Pixel Lens Rebecca Solomon joins us from the Bronx Terminal Market with the latest on this story. Good morning. Hey, good morning, Betty and Vanessa. You know what? It certainly is the coldest day of the year. And I'll tell you what, we felt it all morning long outside. We're fortunate enough to be inside today. But the bottom line is I'm still wearing my long coat head to toe. And it is in support of an event that is happening today. Coats Against COVID, a very unique event today to help out Bronx families in need. They too are going to be walking away with a very warm coat, something certainly everyone needs on days like today and throughout the winter. And thanks to Assemblywoman Joyner, this event is happening. Why is it so important to have coats for COVID? I just want to say thank you for, you know, showcasing today's event. It's an exciting day. We're here surrounded by a team of volunteers who are dedicated to keeping our community safe and keeping our community warm. As you said, today was one of the coldest days. So today we have partnered with New York Cares and they're giving out 3000 coats of all ages for for kids, for adults. And we're, we're today just trying to keep people warm and safe. Um, we're also giving out hand sanitizers and masks. And it's an important event because, listen, my community was hit very hard with COVID. And, you know, with everything now being remote, many people are suffering in silence and are unable and um, unaware of where to get resources for themselves and their families. So today we wanted to put together the event where they can have access to face masks, hand sanitizers, and also coats to keep them warm for the winter. So we encourage everybody to come out today uh, I want to thank the partners of New York Cares. We have Morris Heights Health Center here also partnering with us to give us uh, the hand sanitizers and masks. So it's an important day today. Wonderful, Assemblywoman. Thank you so much. And that's what makes this coat drive so unique. It's not just the coat drive to keep people warm, but it's also to keep people safe against COVID-19, something that is still very much alive throughout the community, throughout the tri-state. So by people coming here, what message do you want to give to them regarding COVID-19? I would like to just let people know, stay connected. You know, the community is all coming together to help one another. And, you know, I'm here as the assemblywoman to listen to their concerns and help deliver resources that can continue to help them to be safe. So I would, my, my main message is definitely come, get the resources and stay connected and share it with your family and friends. You know, with COVID, we were able to see how important it is for the community to come together for, you know, their family members and neighbors. So we're just being friendly and caring partners today in our community. And we appreciate it, thank Assemblywoman. So thank, thank you so you. much. Certainly, if you want to come by and check out this coach drive, you have until 1 o'clock today. It is happening here at the Bronx Terminal right next to the GNC Vitamin Store. And there are um, options to park. You can walk here, whatever's most convenient for you. We'll put that, web that information on our website for you if you need some more pix11.com we're live in the bronx rebecca solomon pix11 news so important especially on a cold day like this rebecca thank you